Hi guys, so welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm at 70 something subscribers, so thank you all. That's number one. Um, so today is going to be like a big haul, so I suggest you get your popcorn, you get your soda, you get your chips, you get your Skittles and M&M's, you get your, you know, movie theater hot dogs, you get it. Okay, and I'll give you a second. Three more seconds. Okay, you sit down. Are you down? Are you sitting down? Are you comfortable? Okay, whether it's your computer desk, your cell phone, your iPad, your tablet, iPod, you comfortable? Okay. So let's get started. So the first thing I'm going to get into is some jewelry. It's nothing, no big, no silver jewelry at all. But I picked these up today at Rainbow. So these are it. These are like these gold diamond shaped earrings. They have like an oval shape, teardrop shape in the middle. And these were four ninety nine. So it looked a little dirty because my child decided to put it in some pink I don't know. So I got this bracelet. It's like a little. She's this one is still wet too. It's like a little wrap bracelet like this. I think like this. It's still wet. Ugh. I don't like my hands been wet. So and I got this from Rainbow too. It was originally five ninety nine. I got it for two dollars. I got this bracelet. My daughter. So R. It was one forty nine. And I got this one Burlington. And I got a black one. It's an A, and it's for my my best friend daughter. So they just like little belt bracelets, like a little adjustable bracelet with one little letter on it. So A for my best friend daughter, and R for my daughter. So. And then I got these little rose earrings. So definitely going. So these are it. And they were only nine last set. These are from Burlington Co Factory too. So that's it for the jewelry. So next we're going to cosmetics. Okay, so next we'll get to um makeup. So I got the famous LA Girl Pro Concealers. I got this one in beautiful bronze. So I, could, I think this is the darkest color they have. And I got this in warm honey. And I got this color for um highlight because I'm trying to learn how to do that. But I got this from my beauty supply store near my house. Not my local one, but one by my house. And these were two forty nine. L one ninety nine IK house. That's crazy. So yeah. So I got these two. So I got this little concealer palette from eBay. This is not the one I wanted, but they gave me this one. I wanted the five color one that had like the peach color, but they gave me the 15 one. So I got this concealer palette. It's 15 colors. I probably won't need, I probably won't need none of these. Probably just need this row. So, um, I'm trying to learn out learn what these colors mean. The white, the uh, mint, the lavender, and the yellow. Because I don't really know. So I'm waiting for Destiny Golly to like put a video up explaining 
how to use it for a darker skin tone. So if she's watching, can you please put a video up of this? But yeah, so this is it. And this was, well, what I paid for was four fifty-four, four sixty-five. And I had, t I complained and I told him I was like. I, this is not what I wanted because you sent me the white one. It was like, well, we can refund you $2. That's not how much I paid for this. You can refund me $4.65 and then you need to send me my, the one I wanted. And I need to buy this date. So they said they couldn't do it, so they refunded me my $4.65. Ain't nobody got time for that. So, and I got this makeup bag from Walmart for $4.88. Or whatever and it's clear and I saw time the infamous she had a Mac one but it was longer of course and I was like I need this like I need a travel one I already got one in my purse but I needed a, I seen hers and I was like I have to have a clear one and it has to be black or pink it doesn't really matter I need one so I got this one from Walmart which I want to see next I want to see bags we'll do bags so I got this clutch from eBay. Um, Y'all seen the pink one in one of my hauls. I don't know why I have this over here, but this is the envelope clutch, the oversized one. This one's made a little better than the pink one, but it looks like this. It's like a suede material. Okay. Don't have no pockets, of course. And it snaps closed. It's so flimsy. It's so flimsy. And it has this back pocket. Kind of like satin in the, in the inside. And the hallway is gold. It closes this way. Um, you can you have adjustable straps. And you can wear it as a little wristlet. But I haven't worn it yet. But this was like $15 on eBay. If you're interested in this bag for $15. Which I don't work for. Man, I recommend you get the cheapest one they have. Just if you wanna, if you're interested in the large, the large, oversized clutches from China, like type in oversized clutch and click from low to high. I mean, from start, starting with the lowest price first, and whichever one you see is like five dollars, you get that one. I made I made that mistake by getting the. The, it's kind of like most expensive one, but you want to make sure, especially with the clutch, you want to make sure you see a picture of them holding the clutch, so you can see how big it could be on you. If you, because they be trying to be swindled. <laughs> this is the pink one. This is the one I paid like nine dollars for, and the tan one I paid fifteen dollars for. I should have got it from the same seller because it's the same damn thing. This is the pink one. If you haven't seen the other video, this is the pink one. So, this thing is nice up there. I got this um, little cross the body bag. And shout out to. Tamar Shots. I can't pronounce her name. But shout out to her because she had put this on one of her outfit of days and I was like, I need that bag. I need that bag. I follow her on Instagram so I can find out where she got the bag from. And surely enough, she put it on Instagram. Go girl. She, she told me what she got. It's, well, she didn't tell me, but she said what she got it from. Because her whole outfit was like from Walmart. And um, her purse came from Walmart too. So I got this purse from Walmart. I think it was like 14, 14, 14 something. So you want to type in like tablet, per type in, well when you go to Walmart, go to crossbodies and type, if you want to search for color, search multicolor or search from low to high. It doesn't really matter, but it's in a $14 range. So this is it, and it has uh, a pocket in the front, okay, and then it has a zipper pocket 
and the front as well. Mm. It's probably like a change pocket. It's not that deep. Okay. And then it has the uh, the actual inner part. And then it has a another change pocket or safety pocket right in the inside. In the back is a tablet holder. Um, this is actually what it's, it's called a. It's called a tablet holder or something like that. So, you can fit your iPad, your any of your tablets. It's a nice size. I don't have a tablet. I don't, I don't have any. I can't put a tablet in there, but I'll put some other things. Um, and I love this color. I seen this color. I was like, I have to have this. Yes, it goes with anything you wear in the springtime that has to do with these colors. It will go, especially with that white and blue, or white and yellow, white and pink, white and navy, white and green, something. Well, not the navy and green, but these bright colors. It'll go with the cam with the this camel color. Yes, God. And it's made by uh, George. So I always love George. Uh, I always love their like their clothing and stuff. So I know, I know I'm gonna love this. Like, and for me being so tall and being big, um, this is the actual crossbody on me. Like it fits good and it's a nice size. I needed this to go out of town because you know you go to the outlets and stuff. You don't want to have no tote bag. You gotta flip, you know, throw up your arm. Then hold your bags with it. You want to be kind of like free. You, you, you want your hands to be free. So this is a good investment, and I love this. So shout out to Tamar Shax. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce that last part. So I got this. Yes, it's neon orange. It is. Don't be alarmed. So I got this neon orange bag. I don't know if I put this in one of my hauls a long time ago. Last shit, last time. But I was like, since I got all these purses, I might just throw this in here. Because I don't know if anybody has ever seen it. But if it is, just skim through this. Uh, fast forward it. Um, so... This has adjustable straps. I think I need this. This has adjustable straps too. And it double opens. So the front first pocket you see is this pocket. Okay. And the inside. Inside it has two like cell phone pockets, one your one for yourself, one for your iPod, you know. This is the pocket. And then it has this damn thing right here. You know, we go to the hood rat stores in the hood. They don't like take shit out. Then it has like a little ID case right here. ID place it. I got this like for like seven dollars. Um, I got this toy Burke bag. It's a black like leather kind of thing or whatever. So it's go hardware. And then it has the leather shoulder strap. Okay, so when you first open it, it has two pockets. I mean, two little, one for your cell phone, one for your camera or something, because it's kind of big. It has the main pocket right here. And then it has a back pocket, so it's two pockets. Okay, and then this is a deep pocket, then it has a zipper pocket for like your chains and stuff. And then when you close the back, it has this it class open it has this back pocket back here it has this little chain thing here so I got this last year in October so that's crazy because I haven't did like a purse thing I haven't did a purse haul at all but get into this this is not the real Tory Burke um, I got this in Atlantic City and it was like $20 <laughs> 
and I needed something for like to be hands free. I actually wanted it. I didn't really need it, but I wanted it. So I got this. So got some say about having fake bags. I don't care. Get your life. Who can get into them? We can get into shoes or clothes. Which I y'all like I think y'all like clothes most. Because I get more views on clothing horse than anything. So I'm gonna say the best for last. Okay, so I got these Lulu Leopard booties from Tarjay. Um, and it's like a nice thick heel. It's not a chunky heel, it's a thicker heel. I don't do the stiletto things. Like I, I be trying. I buy stuff with stiletto heels. Some shoes I can do. I'm not really good at being up in the air too long. Like it's just I don't know. Has a nice platform here. Nice inch and a half or whatever so it's probably like a good I don't know it's probably like a four inch, like a five inch here or something so it zips on the side which I love I love the zipper and boots it's a thick it's a thick thick zipper and it's in the size 11 I don't know if my feet just grows real fast. I don't know what the problem is, but I can't fit no size 11 no more. So I'm in a size 12. So I got this for Valentine's Day and I can't fit them. And I'm really sad about this because I've, like, y'all don't know. Like, y'all don't know. Like, I love leopard. Like, leopard is my thing. And it's so funny because I don't have a lot of leopard things. That, I don't have a lot of leopard clothes. Like, I have one leopard pair of pants, one leopard shirt. I have one leopard hollow shirt. I have a leopard purse, leopard earrings, leopard necklace, leopard ring. And I have two leopard dress and these boots. I have leopard like shoes I wore for prom and that's it you would think that I have everything leopard I have a leopard lamp a leopard um shower, shower curtain and that's it that's all I have anyway so I got these little green wedges from Old Navy and they laced up in the front and I was like I have a uh, armor fatigue jacket in the house I was like I need something to go with this I really don't have nothing to go with this at all so this is like a rubber wedge like it's rubber so and like I got these in size 11 and these fit good and these are wedges like I can't fit these leopard ones because of this part. Like, is this part right here? Like, I don't know if it's not wide enough, or maybe it need to have some stretch in it. Maybe I should try to cut it, add some, you know, elastic or something. I don't know. But I love these shoes. Like, it's so perfect. Like, if I was about that life, I'll paint the bottom red. But I'm not about that life. I don't even look right in this area with no damn rear bottoms. But back to these women, they laced up in the front. And I think this was $20. I think I got like 20% off, 15% off or something at Old Navy. And I got this size 11. And they are so cute. They was featuring in one of my, um, featuring in my, my Valentine's Day recap. The last outfit. I had these shoes on. They're so comfortable. I went to the movies. And they was giving people was giving me stays. They was like, girl, yes, she can dress and she big hold on. <laughs> I'm so ratchet, like you don't understand. I'm so ratchet. So I got these. I love these shoes. I got these little cool wedges from Payless. I ordered them online. I had like um I, look, I'm watching TV. Um, I ordered these on Payless.com. I ordered some, my daughter some shoes too. I, was, I got 15 or 20% off of these. So this is the corkscrew bottom and a purple, I mean, 
and the suede material at the top. These are so perfect for the spring. Like, if you don't have these, like, you have to get your life because there's no way in the world you don't have these shoes. Like, they on sale with $20. $20. Go to RetailMeNot.com. I will put the link at the bottom. RetailMeNot.com. Type in Payless.com in the search engine. Okay. You will find a coupon code. They might even have 30% off. Get you these shoes. You watching this? Get you these shoes. Okay. There's no game. It's no game. And they comfortable, they comfortable, like I'm about to cuss, like I love these shoes, like I have to get another color, like I just can't settle for one color. Like, they're originally $27. And they don't sell for $19.99? And y'all ain't get them yet? What you doing? Like what you doing with your money if you ain't get these shoes yet? Just because they pay less don't mean nothing. Get your life. So, we saving the best for last, right? I like sweetheart. I wanted to be a little fashion right. classic, a little bit. So, I went to Burlington Co. Factory for the first time in years. I don't go to Burlington Co. Factory because I think it's overrated. People be going used to, I mean, it be some people used to like, you know, I got this from Burlington. They're so cheap. They got nice stuff, blah, blah, blah. I don't think so. I don't. I don't. And they still have to go on today. I don't feel like they have good things like maybe it's just my Burlington it just could be that anyway I got this skirt this is the waistband here this is what the pattern looks like it's like a tulle skirt Y'all see this print? I love this print. So this sheer is the outer layer. And a slip in the inside. So tell us a little bit about it. She wore this dress to Nancy Reagan's wedding. She Day. It was an expensive dress. You could tell just by looking at it. Let's see the dress. <laughs> okay. So I love this. I'm going to get some of those gold ones that came in a little of the wedges. Yes, I love this. Like, I love this. It's not a New York big city wedding dress. No, it's not. And it looks very dated. I know there's a lot of history and sexual here, but what is So I got this dress from Old Navy. And it's a, like a. Um, My mom will say where it's a dress. It's like an orangey color or something. It's the same color as the pants I wore in my plus size clothing haul video. Well, not wool, but I had shown. Like that citrus tomato y color or something. I don't know. But I got this in 4X. And it's still on the site right now for $15.97. And I got this for like 20% off or 15% off. I'm not sure. But this is entirely too big. I could have I got 2X and been perfectly fine. But it's really long. It comes like to my calf. Like if I if it would have been a body contrast, I would have I wouldn't have mind it being this long. But since it's more of a skater dress, I wanted to be like tighter at the top and like flowy at the bottom. Not like not just I don't I didn't like it. So I was like, it's fifteen dollars, and plus they ain't send no daggone uh, return slip. They weren't trying to give me the return at. <laughs> but um, I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna probably try to get it taken in or get it made into a bodycon dress. I'm not sure of how I want to do it. But I got this little jumpsuit and I got it from Simply B. I don't remember how much this dagger thing costs, but I know I got 30% off and free shipping. So it ties up at the waist right here. Yeah, it ties up at the waist right here. And they're pants. So they're really long. And I'm 5'9 and it comes 
it's long with me. Like it comes to my foot. Like if I wore heels, it wouldn't be long, of course. But only thing I think I wish is that it didn't have this tie. Maybe I'll tie it and cut it so you can't see it. And you wear like a a, a skinny belt, like an orange color skinny belt, because the actual orange color skinny belt came with that orange dress. And I paid it with this when I tried it on today. And it went so well with my new, like, open toe strappy sandal. Like, it went so well with this. And it ties it in the back. Just a little bit. So, as you can see, it's, it is from Simply B. And I got this in a... I am really shocked that Kelly did Without deconstruction, so go back to the dressing room, get me that dress back, and you guys are gonna go shopping with Sam. Coming up, shopping brings up the critical. I don't know what size it is. I think it's a 26. I'm worried my mom is just saying no because she's pushing for my grandmother's dress. So this is the last item. I got this um, tube dress. I don't know if it's a maxi dress or what, but I'm so tall that rainbow sh maxi shit is not maxi shit to me. So it kind of like flares at the top, like on the boob part, kind of like flowy or whatever, and it cinches in. And the boob part isn't really that. It's really that much. I don't know why they think Big Girl's boots are small. I don't know what the fuck they think. So, it's the same print all the way down. So, to me, it'd probably be like in the middle of my leg, in the middle of my calf. Like, it'd be a little pa about four inches past my knee. So, I love this dress. And, of course, I got it in a 3X. And it's so funny because this is new look. So I'm thinking that, you know, maybe new looks is start new look is starting to make some of Rainbow Clothes. And they do have a website, rainbowshops.com. I will put that in the description box as well. But the stuff that's in the store is not compared to the the um online. Like it's so much more stuff in the store. So much more. Like you're wasting your time going online. You're wasting your time. It's, so many things like I was in Rainbow Have I haven't been to Rainbow in months like months and I was just like I need, I need this I need this I need this and I, I was so excited to be there I was like let me just calm down let me not go splurging but the price was $16.99 and I just love this like I don't know if I want to wear this for Easter or I don't know what I'm going to wear this with, but I was going to wear it with this. So, t especially with this this t this corkscrew against this, like. I'm watching commercials. I'm so sorry, but I love this dress. Like my boyfriend picked it out too, and it's so funny because I had either two. I had a peplum shirt or this dress, and he was like, "I don't like that shirt. Get this." And I was like, "Like, I feel so obligated to wear this that he picked it out. Like he hardly ever picks anything out for me. Hardly ever. And he's happy that he picked it out too. I feel like we've been together for like three months, and you know he's all excited and stuff. But yeah, so." That is my haul. If you want to see anything like any type of videos, like, because I'm running out of videos to do, and it's really frustrating because I really want to be on YouTube, just, like, show y'all stuff, just anything. Like, I got a new Christmas tree, whatever. Just, I want, I want to, like, interact with y'all. So, if y'all have any requests for anything, just, like, let me know. Let me know in the bottom, in the comment section, or in my inbox. It don't really matter. Um, no rude comments please <laughs> but that is it for my haul and i will see you guys in the next video